Angiokeratomas are characterized by telangiectatic dilated capillaries in the upper dermis, resulting in warty epidermal changes. There are several types of angiokeratoma, including solitary angiokeratoma, angiokeratoma of mibelli, angiokeratoma of fordyce, these occur on the scrotum and occasionally vulva, angiokeratoma circumscriptum, and angiokeratoma corporis diffusum. This is the type of angiokeratoma that is associated with Fabry disease. In this case, the angiokeratoma is a type called angiokeratoma of mibelli. These are rare, arise in children or adolescents. They are more frequent in females than males, and they cause papules on the dorsum of the fingers and toes, and they may also occur on the knees, elbows and breasts. The size is around 3 to 5 millimetres across. Histologically, in angiokeratomas, there are dilated capillaries in the upper dermis, and these may extend into the middermis. The ureter ridges may enclose the dilated capillaries, and there is overlying hyperkeratosis. This is a low power view of an angiokeratoma of Mibelli. You can see the dilated capillaries immediately beneath the epidermis with overlying hyperkeratosis. Here you can appreciate the rather warty appearance of this angiokeratoma. And here we are zooming into the hyperkeratosis. And in this area the ureter ridges almost enclose the dilated capillary.